So as long as nobody tampers with the human recipe, with human nature itself, I will always feel blessed by being around other people. And that's true around the world. Like I've, I've never been to a country, and I've been to scores of countries where I didn't, given a week, really like it and like the people. So yeah, bad leaders are like a, you know, recurring theme in human history. <laughs> like they're mostly bad and we've got an unusually bad set right now, but we'll have better ones at some point. I just don't want to, I don't, the one, the one thing I don't like more than nuclear weapons and more than AI, the one thing that really, really bothers me is the idea of using technology to change the human brain permanently because you're tampering with the secret sauce. You're tampering with God's creation and um, totally evil. I mean, I literally sat there the other day with Klaus Schwab. I was with Klaus Schwab. It was like a total moron. I'm like 100 years old and like has no idea what's going on in the world. But he's like one of these guys who, speaking of mediocre, everyone's so afraid of Klaus Schwab. I don't think Klaus Schwab is going to be organizing anything again. He's just like a total figurehead, like a douchebag. But anyway, but he was talking and he's reading all these talking points, like all what the cool kids are talking about at Davos and whatever. And he starts talking about it in his survey and his accent. He was saying, I think it's so important that we follow in an ethical way, always in an ethical way, of course, very ethical. I'm a very ethical man. That we follow the, you know, using technology to improve the human mind and implant the chips in the brain. And I'm like, okay, you have no idea what you're talking about. You're like as senile as Joe Biden. But what was so striking is that no one in the room was like, wait, what? You're fucking with people's brains? 